More people will have health care available to them as a result of this bill. I serve on two committees that have crafted uh, pieces of this legislation, Ways and Means, uh, and the Education and Workforce Committee. Uh, and I would say that all of us, and I think this is probably shared on both sides of the aisle, we want all Americans to have access to the health care and to the insurance that they choose for themselves. Uh, and I think, as I said, I think uh, we share that. And certainly as a, as a small business owner myself, you know, I can relate to business owners who want to ensure that their employees, their team members, have access to the health care. They want them to be healthy. They want them to go home from work healthy. Uh, and they're very interested uh, in ensuring that their employees have affordable coverage. This committee did uh, focused on expanding the choice arrangements, which is a system that will uh, provide numerous benefits for employees and small businesses because it lets job creators offer their workers cash to purchase individual health plans, which will help by ensuring that workers, if they move from one job to another, can take their health plan with them. They're more portable. So that's a great change that will help a lot of individuals. And then on the Education and Workforce Committee, we wrote legislation that expands association health plans, or AHPs, which enable employers and the self-employed to band together. I've heard from a lot of self-employed individuals uh, in my community who have trouble accessing health insurance that they prefer. This would allow them to band together and across state lines to purchase uh, health coverage for themselves and in the case of small businesses for their workers. Yeah, another minute? Yeah, another minute. Gentleman's recognized. Just one other thing I'd like to uh, mention in this bill that I think is uh, very positive. We took action to preserve uh, self-insurance. This is a system in which large and small employers pay for health care services directly uh, instead of purchasing plans with a large insurer, which leads to savings uh, and, and leads to collaboration uh, between employers and workers at their company uh, to ensure a better wellness uh, uh, approach to keep employees healthy uh, and not be required uh, to access uh, health care costs. So it, it helps uh, the workers and it, it saves costs across the board. So self-insurance is another part of this bill that we preserve, which I think is very great. The bottom line is that American workers and businesses need affordable and flexible health care options. This package of bills achieves those goals, and I urge my colleagues to support this legislation. Thank you, and I yield back.